So this question is a diagram question. Any question that provides some visual input, I'm gonna call a diagram question. More specifically, we have a shape here, and that shape is the right triangle. So what do we know about this right triangle? So the question says, in the figure above, tan B equals 3 fourths. So let's think about well, what does that mean, right? What does it mean if the tangent of B is equal to 3 over 4? Well, we know from Sokotoa that the tangent of an angle, right, tan X, is equal to the opposite side, O, over the adjacent side, A. So this 3 over 4 has to relate to the opposite of that angle B, to the adjacent. But which triangle do we focus on? Do we focus on the smaller right, tri or smaller right triangle B, D, E? Or do we focus on the larger right triangle B, A, C? The truth is we actually focus on both. So because we're looking at both, I am going to draw each right triangle separately. So here is B, D, E. And based upon tan B equaling 3 over 4, I would say that this opposite to angle B is 3x, and this side that's adjacent to angle B is 4x. Now I'm adding the x in because just because the ratio says 3 over 4 does not mean that the lengths are actually equal to 3 and 4. It just means that once you um, write them as a ratio, they reduce to 3 over 4. So they could be 3 over 4. They could be like this length from D to E could be 3. And the length from B to D could be 4. But it doesn't necessarily have to. So I've learned to never just put those numbers down and instead to put an X next to them because there could be a multiple of those numbers. So here's my next right triangle, the larger one we have. And that is right triangle B, A, C. And again, because of what we just saw for tan B, I'm going to say that this is the opposite side, which is 3x, and this is the adjacent side, which is 4x. Okay. The next thing we are told is that BC equals 15. So that's very useful. So here is 15. And I should make a note here that I have all three sides here. So I could just say 3x squared plus 4x squared I'm sorry, 3x squared like that plus 4x squared like that is equal to 15 squared and use Pythagorean theorem. But I'm always checking for shortcuts when it comes to this test because I know I don't have a lot of time. So there is a special right triangle called the 3, 4, 5 right triangle. And it looks like, right, if I were to multiply 5 times 3, I'd get 15. So, and I see the 3 and the four here, right? So I'm assuming that I just have to multiply those numbers by three as well. So when I do that, my three X becomes three times three, and therefore this is nine. And four times three becomes 12, right? So tri right triangle BAC is in essence a three, four, five right triangle. It's just that those side lengths have been multiplied by three. So this is useful for us. Um, the next thing we're told is that DA equals four. So I don't have a DA in either of the right triangles that I've drawn, but I do have DA in my original right triangle, and I know that that's four. Now, how does that help me? Well, I know from here that the entire length of BA is 12, which makes the length from B to D equal eight, right? Because I want this entire length to be 12. I know this part is four, so this part must be eight. Now, if that's eight, notice I've already labeled that side as four X. So I'm saying eight equals four X, right? Eight is four X. Well, how does that work? How is it possible that eight is four X? Well, the only way that's possible is if this X right here is equal to two. So if that X is equal to two, then so is this X here, right? So we would have a side eight here, and then we'd have three times two, making this a six here for the length of DE. And again, this is also a three, four, five right triangle, right? Because six is just three times two. Eight is just four times two. Therefore, the hypotenuse here should just be five times two, which equals 10. The question then says, what is the length of DE? Well, we've already found it. The length of DE is equal to six. So that is our answer. Six is the correct answer for this question.